today I'm going to be playing out the 2023 season for the Los Angeles Rams, but for every touchdown that Cooper Cup scores, we get to add a 99 overall player to this team. So, I mean, by the end of the video, as long as things actually go my way today, the Rams should be an absolute super team. But this is what the offense looks like to start things off. I mean, honestly, they are pretty solid. But on the other hand, I mean, other than Aaron Donald, this defense is actually terrible. So, I mean, I'm really hoping that Cooper Cup can go off in the first game because I mean that defense clearly needs some upgrades but in week one we got to play the Seattle Seahawks Seattle did start with the ball but somehow our defense stopped them on fourth down even though they really suck I'm assuming Aaron Donald had a lot to do with that but we have crazy bad field positions so we have the ball at the 17 which kind of sucks but hopefully Nakua can be open that's kind of a bad pass but we're gonna catch it so that's a first down I'll probably get a new quarterback in the future but I mean for the most part Matthew Stafford is a pretty solid quarterback so as long as he's not out here throwing like five interceptions a game i'll probably roll with him for a while because obviously i mean the first upgrades that we're gonna need to make is for the defense because they really need some help i mean aaron donald's pretty much out there all by himself that's an absolute dot let's go okay just like that we're gonna be in scoring position seahawks did end up forcing a third down after that though so i mean it's third and ten we really need this play to work i'm gonna put all of my trust in the hands of cup right now Oh, I can't even go for that. He's locked up and we are getting sacked. I mean, that's definitely not the best way to end off a drive like that. Things were looking so good for us up until now. Please tell me that's good. Oh my God, we missed the PAT attempt. Seattle ended up scoring after that missed field goal as well. So now we're down seven, nothing. I mean, I actually can't believe we didn't make that because the Rams kicker has been pretty solid this season. I thought, oh bro, that's a good run. We just hit the two minute warning though. So I mean, I don't want to say we have to rush right now. We do have two timeouts in the full two minutes, but actually that might work out for a touchdown. That's a brick though. Seattle brought up a third down after that too. So I mean, the second drive is not looking anywhere near as good as the first drive was. I'm really really hoping that cooper cup can save the day here that's a dot let's go okay we're still rolling i'm gonna try and go for a shot with atwell here though if this works out we should be able to just hand it off to cup for an easy touchdown and it looks like that is going to be the case i really hope this play works but the way the defense is set up it's kind of 50 50 right now actually no that's another brick come on man the thing is like we don't really have a whole lot of short pass plays with cooper cup so this is pretty much the only play that's gonna work for us this time he's gonna be open and he held on to it through the contact so we're actually gonna score a touchdown on this drive thankfully so that's gonna tie the game up right before halftime so i mean we have a pretty good game going so far we're back out here in the third quarter though we're still all knotted up at seven so i mean if we can score here we're gonna have the lead and atwell is gonna be wide open for a massive pickup and we somehow snuck away i mean by the looks of it we are already off to one hell of a start to this half 20 yards to go after one play and we're in for a touchdown. I mean, that's actually ridiculous. And it looks like Nakua is going to get it all the way to the one yard line. The thing is, I mean, if I wanted to bring that in for a touchdown, I definitely could have. But hopefully this works out from Cobb. Okay, thank you. He caught it. So it looks like I'm not going to regret that decision. That's going to be his second touchdown on the game. And just like that, we now have the lead. We're coming back out here in the fourth quarter, though. We are all tied up at 14 with two minutes on the clock. All we need to do, though, is get a field goal to win this thing. That's going to be a first down. I mean, just like that, we're pretty much in field goal position. We got struck with a penalty after that, though. So, I mean, it's second and 17. Either way, I mean, I feel like we need to be a lot closer because our kicker did miss the... Uh, field goal last time that's an absolute oh bro that would have been a crazy grab since he couldn't catch that though i mean now things are starting to get dangerous it's third and 17 this play of atwell has been working for the most part we gotta rush that off but somehow we held on to it that was the biggest play we've had all game by far that was actually huge for us so now we're in field goal position ah oh, that that really screws things up it seems like i've ran this play like a million times today but it seems like it keeps working when i need it to so i'm gonna try and go back to atwell well here somehow he's still wide open i'm just hoping we don't mess up and throw a pick here because it's kind of dangerous to put in the air right now but i want to try and get one more touchdown with cop that was almost it if Diggs didn't get his hand on that that would have a hundred percent been a touchdown but since he did now it's second and goal I'm going to try and go for a shorter play this time. Mm, that's going to be close. Come on, stay up, stay up, stay up. I mean, we're literally one yard short after that. If we can get a touchdown right now, that's pretty much the dagger considering there's only 28 seconds on the clock. But if this doesn't work, we're going to have to kick a
a field goal and he held on to it it seems like he gets smoked every time when he's in the end zone but i mean thankfully he has not really dropped anything today so cooper cup has been going off and that right there should give us the win and it looks like it's going to i mean we barely snuck out of seattle with the dub they did put up one hell of a fight but either way after that we're gonna be one and oh to start off the season but since cup finished that game with three touchdowns we got three new additions to this team and as i said it's pretty clear that aaron donald needs some help so we got him some help by picking up derwin james miles garrett and chris jones i mean we still have a lot of holes to fill in that defense but we should be a lot better than we were last week and we're gonna need to be because as you can see we got to play the 49ers in week two i mean it looks like derwin james is already doing his job because in the first drive of the game he got an interception so we have great field position to start our drive off and that's gonna be a first down i didn't really run the ball a whole lot in the first game if it's gonna work like this though i might keep it on the ground a bit more this game come on this time it looks like we're getting shut down i mean either way that's still a solid four yard pickup it's not like we lost yardage or anything but i'm gonna put in the air after that and hopefully we can find higby that's gonna work out for another first we are actually rolling right now i mean it's pretty clear that the 49ers are a very tough team to face this defense is absolutely loaded but so far it seems like we're actually keeping up with them and coop oh no we got hit that really sucks because if we didn't get smoke there that would have a hundred percent been a touchdown but anyways i mean now it's second and ten actually i might be able to go back for him on this play that's gonna work out for a touchdown either way so we're in for an early score that was actually one hell of a drive i mean i know we had great field position to begin with but either way i mean we got shit done so that's gonna give us the lead first 49ers did score after that though so i mean it looks like their offense is starting to wake up which is something i did not want to see and we're getting smoked by chase young 49ers got to stop after that too so i mean now it's third and nine this is kind of a dangerous play but i'm gonna run it anyway anyways i'm hoping nakua can be open because this guy's been unstoppable lately and it looks like he is not slowing down whatsoever so that's another huge play i know this is like a cooper cup touchdown video but i feel like i should have done puka because he has been going off i mean cup has been the one scoring all the touchdowns obviously but it seems like nakua is getting all the work done same thing goes for atwell because nakua and atwell are leading our team in yardage and receptions right now i'm gonna try and go for cooper cup on this play though looks like that should work out that is gonna be very close to a first down it is gonna be third and two though since we couldn't pick that up i'm just gonna keep it on the ground and hopefully we don't get smoke that's a solid pickup i could bring this back if i wanted to but we're gonna go out at the one and hopefully i don't regret that because if we throw a pick that would really suck but i'm praying we can get another touchdown with cooper cup here that's close we're gonna get it though okay that's gonna be two on the game for him already i mean it seems like we're off to a pretty hot start right now but since the 49ers offense is starting to wake up this might end up being a shootout we're coming back out here in the fourth quarter though once again our defense got another interception so purdy's kind of struggling against our defense today which is reasonable because i mean we got derwin james so obviously you got to worry about him and then our pass rush is absolutely ridiculous considering we have miles garrett aaron aaron donald and um what's his face chris jones that's another first down from cop i mean if we can score here i'd say i should probably put the game away i mean we already have a pretty healthy 10 point lead but if we give the ball up right now they definitely have a chance to come back considering it's san francisco they do no oh don't get in don't get in we're out at the one probably sounds really stupid that i'm like trying not to score a touchdown on that play but i'm trying to get as many with cooper cup as i can because obviously this team still needs a lot of upgrades that's a bad play i mean to be fair this defense hasn't really done a whole lot that sack is one of the first big plays that they have had today i'm gonna try and go back to cup here oh we're getting smoked again okay i might have jinxed myself it's almost like they can hear me because as soon as i started talking bad about this defense they started to go off so hopefully this play works out if not we're kind of screwed let's go that's gonna be three on the day for cooper cup and as i said since we scored there we're gonna be up by 17 so that realistically that should put the game away and it looks like it's going to san francisco was not able to pull off a miracle in the three minutes they had on the clock so we're already off to a 2-0 start but after that performance we got to add another three players to this team i know stafford was doing well but it was time for a change so we picked up patrick mahomes and we also got christian mccaffrey and then for the defense we went ahead and picked up patrick Sertan 
maintain. I mean, after all of those pickups, I think this team should be pretty insane. But in week two, we have another tough matchup against the Bengals, who are also 2-0. But obviously, someone's perfect record is going to get messed up today. Someone's got to go home with a loss, unless we somehow tie, which would actually be pretty lame. So hopefully that doesn't happen. McCaffrey is gone right now. Oh my god, bro. That is actually a ridiculous run. Are you kidding me? Seems like that pickup is already paying itself off. That was actually a crazy start to this game. I do not regret picking this guy up whatsoever, which is good. That's a stop. If we got two crazy plays back to back, that would have been insane. But either way, I mean, the guy's got 42 yards on the ground already, two plays into this game, which is actually insane. I'm just going to keep this on the ground, actually. I don't know if this is going to work out, but Mahomes does have some decent legs on him. We held him to a field goal, though, if you haven't already noticed. So we're only down 3 0. We are in field goal position, but I'm hoping this works out for a first, and it looks like it's going to. I almost want to feed McCaffrey to touchdown here because he has done literally everything on this drive, but I mean, I can't. I got to try and get some more upgrades, so hopefully, Cup can be open here. That's dangerous. Uh, we got it, though, and we're going to stay up, but we stepped out of bounds. We were actually so close to bringing that in, but either way, I'm hoping three yards won't be a problem for us. That should work out. That's another touchdown for Cup. It seems like he's good at holding on to it through the contact, because every time I run that play, he gets smoked, but he hasn't dropped it yet. So that's going to be his first touchdown of the game to give us the lead. The Bengals did end up scoring a touchdown after that, though. So we're down by three points once again. We have crazy field position, though, because, I mean, we had an insane punt return. It seems like our special teams unit has actually been doing pretty well today, which is definitely nice to see. I'm going to try and go for a shot with Nakua here. I have a feeling Cup's going to be locked up. Up, but if he can somehow get open it looks like that's not going to be the case so i'm just going for you that's a dot okay i mean the way mccaffrey's been playing today though i honestly just want to keep feeding him the ball because it seems like every time i put the ball in his hands something insane happens that's almost another first i thought mahomes was going to be the best pickup for this team but so far it's been mccaffrey i mean this guy has been unstoppable today that's another first down. Okay, I'm gonna try and go back to Cup on this play though. Honestly, I can't really see this working out for a touchdown. Best case scenario, it should be a first down. It looks like, oh, no way, hold on. We almost squeezed in. Since we couldn't get in though, I mean, my boy is one yard short once again. I think this should work out though. Actually, he's kind of double team right now. Never mind. the guy got off of him. That's another touchdown. Once again, like as I've been saying all day, this guy just doesn't drop the football at all. It doesn't matter how hard you smoke him. He's held on to it every time so that's gonna give us the lead back coming back out here in the third quarter though as you can see the Bengals are kind of getting demolished right now i mean it is only a two score game but if we score here that should probably put things away considering we're almost in the fourth quarter i thought they put up a much bigger fight but i mean at the same time i i keep forgetting how stacked our defense is i mean it's actually ridiculous that's not gonna work so now it's third and 19 i'm just gonna put my trust in the hands of nakua i mean this guy has been going off as i said last game he's leading our team in receptions right now and that's gonna be another one for a massive pickup once again i don't want to get ahead of myself but i mean so far it seems like every time we dig a hole for ourselves we are out of it the next play mccaffrey come on bro please that's a pretty good gain again that juke definitely helped out because if we couldn't get past him that probably would have been a loss of yardage but anyways i'm gonna try and go back to puka here who's kind of locked up actually never mind he's open now that's another huge play i could bring this in for a touchdown but you already know what we're doing two yards to go obviously we're gonna try and go back to cooper cup i mean this guy has not dropped a single pass today so i have like max trust in him and he's gonna catch it again so that's three on the game and that touchdown right there should put the game away as well because i mean we're in the fourth quarter now and we're also up by three scores and i mean it looks like we ended up scoring again after that too so we're gonna sneak out of cincinnati with our first blowout win of the season to move us to 3-0 and but I mean for the third week in a row our boy Cooper Cup ended that game with three touchdowns so once again we got three new additions to this team for the offense we picked up Trent Williams and for the defense we went ahead and picked up TJ Watt and Roquan Smith but after that we simmed to week four because I wanted to end things off with a bit of a challenge now that this team is absolutely stacked as you can see we're going to be taking on the Philadelphia Eagles we're 4-0 as well because we ended up beating the Colts last week and it was an absolute blowout 
I want to see if Christian McCaffrey can pick off where he left off, though. I mean, it's going to be tough considering how crazy of a performance he had last week. And I mean, now we're playing the Eagles. So obviously, this defense is going to be a whole lot harder to play against than since he's. But if anyone can go off, it's going to be Christian McCaffrey. That is a first down. I'm going to give him one more run. If this doesn't work out, I'll probably put in the air. But I mean, it looks like that's going to work out for another first down. Oh my god, bro. This guy is insane, man. And just like last time, man. Three plays into the game, and the guy's already got 41 yards on the ground. So it's looking like he's probably gonna have another crazy performance. And just like that, Puka Nakua is gonna put us in scoring position. 12 yards is still quite a bit, but I mean, hopefully Cooper Cup can end things off right here. I'm thinking Darius Slay is probably gonna be a problem, though actually that should work out that's close okay i, I didn't think we caught that I was like 90 percent sure that maddox batted that away but somehow cooper cup still came down with it so that's gonna give us the lead first and after that we got a stop so we're still up seven nothing and our special teams unit brought the ball all the way back to the 44 yard line so once again we have great field position to start this drive off and i mean if things go my way here we're gonna be up by two scores i mean it looks like that's probably what's gonna happen i mean if we can keep this up this honestly might be another blowout this team is actually so crazy right now we have so many weapons to work with that's probably yeah okay i i had a feeling i shouldn't have put that one in the air darius slay was bound to be a problem at some point i mean we're coming back out here in the fourth quarter as you can see things are not going our way right now that last interception kind of screwed us because it seems like the eagles just had all the momentum after that so now we're getting cooked i don't think there's any chance in hell that we can come back but i mean at the very least i want to try and get one more touchdown with our boy cooper cup so hopefully that that can happen McCaffrey still doesn't look like he's slowing down at all that's another huge pickup again I could have brought that in for a touchdown but instead we're just gonna try and hand it off to our boy Cooper Cup again and hopefully we can end this game off with a respected two touchdowns we almost got smoke there that was a brick defense is putting a lot more pressure on us than any other team has this season which is kind of expected considering we're going up against Philly okay there we go that's it that's gonna be his second touchdown of the game i mean we're still gonna be down by a whole lot i don't think we really have a chance at coming back but we have patrick mahomes so it's definitely possible but i mean after that philly scored another touchdown which pretty much put things away i mean we had a good run but they are gonna hand us our first loss of the season i mean even though we took a fat l we still got to add another two players after that game so i just went ahead and maxed out the defense by picking up josh allen and jesse bates i mean as you can see this defense is actually beautiful we are absolutely loaded and on the other hand i mean the offense is nowhere near as good as the defense but they're still solid but i mean you know what they say defense wins championships and our defense by the looks of it is definitely capable of winning us a championship so hopefully that can be the case and it looks like we're gonna finish off the season going 15 and 2 to absolutely annihilate the division and that also gives us the number one seed and it looks like we're gonna be playing the packers in the divisional round and as you can see green bay got absolutely annihilated so now we play the cowboys for a trip to the super bowl and it looks like we're barely gonna sneak out with the dub this time but either way now we play the Bengals in a super bowl rematch i don't want to say this is going to be a walk in the park or anything like that but i mean considering we did end up beating the Bengals last time and also our team has gotten 10 times better since our last matchup i mean there's no question about it that we definitely have the upper hand in this game mccaffrey's kind of going off right now i'm gonna try and go for one more run and hopefully this works out if not i'll probably have to put in the air but i mean so far this guy has not been slowing down at all this season that's just short of the first though i was gonna put it in the air but i mean one yard we should be able to pick that up on the ground pretty easily so hopefully i don't eat my words looks like that's gonna be good we barely got that but we are gonna get the first after that though i'm gonna run a slant route and hopefully puka can get to this i mean the way the defense is set up he might be wide open here actually that's not gonna work i'm just gonna go for you higby's gonna get it i'm gonna try and go for a shot with cooper cup after that though i mean this play really hasn't been working today if i'm being brutally honest with you but this time it looks like he's gonna be wide open so that's gonna set us up i mean after that we only need 11 yards for the touchdown i'm gonna try and finish this off with mccaffrey because i mean this guy definitely deserves to get in the end zone since he got shut down though i mean i don't want to risk it we have great field position right now so i'm just gonna put in the air i feel like this play should work 
we're gonna find puka that's another touchdown okay we're up just like that so it's looking like we're already off to a pretty hot start to this game i think we should be able to roll all over cincinnati if i'm being brutally honest with you i mean it looks like we're gonna sneak away with the dub so we're gonna win the super bowl which is definitely good news but joe burrow put up a much bigger fight than i expected him to i mean that's actually insane considering how stacked our defense is you guys all saw it so after that performance i mean i honestly kind of feel bad for joe burrow but i mean at the same time that's gonna give the rams a super bowl which was well deserved after the season we had but as you can see for the second time we're gonna take down the rams in the super bowl because patrick mahomes and the rams are gonna be hoisting the lombardi trophy that's gonna do it for this one if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and subscribe it'll really help out the channel and if you have any video ideas feel free to drop them down in the comment section below i'll try to get to as many of them as i can and while you're down there comment the most random thing you can think of so we can confuse everybody in the comment section but other than that i'll see you guys in the next one peace out